In this video is primarily about how to generate this kind of drawing using the SOLIDWORKS drawing feature. Once you have made your part or assembly, the SOLIDWORKS allows you to create the engineering drawing of that particular component or assembly. So in order to generate this kind of sheet with your own boxes and with your own formatting, it's just easy. You have to follow the steps. Once you are in your assembly window or you are in your component window, if you want to make your drawing from component, just simply move to file option and then to make drawing for assembly. But here you need to stop and see that the SOLIDWORKS are providing you two options, standard sheet sizes and custom sheet sizes. In standard sheet sizes, there are four to five options for you, like A4, A3, A2 and A1, but you don't want it. You want a custom sheet size where you can format according to your own choice and according to your own taste. So you have to just adjust the width and the height. Uh, so I have entered here the width and height of A4 size paper or you can enter the width and height of the size whatever you want. Once you are done with size, just click OK. And SOLIDWORKS will provide you with a blank sheet and you can just format it according to your own what are your requirements so in order to format it and in order to draw the boxes like here I have drawn you just need to right click on it and press edit sheet format now you are in editable mode you can draw whatever you want like I need the boxes at the bottom I will use a rectangle Yes, I will use a rectangle and that's okay. Now, if I exit the editable mode, I will get the rectangular box at the bottom. Or you can also change the color or you can also change the width of a line and whatever you want. For example, right click, edit shop format and I want a circle at the bottom. Okay, now I will get a circle at the bottom. So this is how you have to create your own format and make sure to save here from save sheet format and you will save your format and just have a look just example i will save this format as a, a new a new one double one okay i will save this and then i will exit this board don't save Okay, and now when I will make the drawing from the assembly, I will browse my own created sheet. Just for example, I will here, uh, this is new double one, okay. And when I, once I click okay, SOLIDWORKS will provide me with this sheet. And now I can drag my own views on the sheet. So this is how you create this sheet in SOLIDWORKS according to your own choice. And the last thing is that once you are done with all your settings and dimensionings and views just move over to here and you can save this drawing as a pdf format just move to the print option and uh, just adjust the page setup for example i want this in a portrait mode or you can choose your landscape depending upon the requirement so i can have a preview of how my drawing is going to look alike so i will click on the preview button and uh, it will look something like this so i can print and save it as a pdf so this is a short video about how to create your own sheet how to save the sheet format and how to print or how to save the drawing in the pdf format hope it will help you <laughs>